In this video, we will solve an application problem using a linear equation in one variable. We will also be using the problem solving strategy outlined here below, where number one, we're told to read the problem, make sure you understand all the words and ideas, two, identify what you are looking for, three, name what you are looking for, and choose a variable to represent that quantity, four, translate into an equation, five, solve the equation, six, check the answer, and seven, write the answer as a complete sentence. Let's go ahead and read the problem. Marissa paid $18,750 for her new car, which was $1,095 less than the sticker price. Determine the sticker price of the car. So it's important to recognize that because she paid less than sticker price, the sticker price must be more than $18,750. And because we are looking for the sticker price, we need to represent this amount using a variable. Let's go ahead and use the variable s and let s equal the sticker price of the car. And now we've already completed the first three steps of the problem solving strategy. The next step is to translate the information into an equation. So because Marissa paid $18,750, we begin our equation with this amount. Because this was $1,095 less than the sticker price, this amount must equal the sticker price minus $1,095. And because we're using the variable s for the sticker price, 18,750 must equal s minus 1,095. So this is the equation from the given information. Step five is to solve the equation. To solve this equation, we need to isolate S on one side of the equation, and because S is on the right side, we will isolate S on the right side, which means we need to undo the subtraction by performing the opposite operation to both sides of the equation. To undo minus 1,095, we add 1,095 to both sides of the equation. Let's simplify the right side first. On the right, we have negative 1,095 plus 1,095, which is zero. The right side of the equation simplifies to S. We have S equals 18,750 plus 1,095 is equal to 19,845, which means the sticker price was $19,845. But before we write this as a sentence, let's complete step six which is to check the answer in the problem. To do this, we will substitute 19,845 for S into the original equation to verify that it does satisfy the equation. Performing the substitution gives us 18,750 equals 19,845 minus 1,095. Simplifying the right side, we do get 18,750 18,750 equals 18,750 is true, verifying the solution is correct. The last step is to write the answer as a complete sentence, which is the sticker price of the car was $19,845. I hope you found this helpful.